Hey, Shinobu. Did you hear thunder or something just a second ago? No, but I did hear you screaming. Did you have a dream about being chased by a pregnant girl you dumped? A dream? Oh, my shoulder's killing me. You sound like an old man. Maybe I'm getting sick. I've been getting chills lately. Mitsuru, are you headed back? Would it be okay if I watch another video in your room tonight, huh? <laughs> you know, there are times I wish I were as carefree as you are. What's with you, Mitsuru? Oh, it's Tag! Hi, Tag! Tag? Yeah, Tag! It's Cat, backwards! That's just like you. I suppose you'd name a rabbit Tibar. Right! And a panda would be Adnap. Greenwood for about a week now, and by the way, she's a girl cat. Hmm? What's wrong? <laughs> you must have been teasing that cat, Mitsuru. I've never seen her before. She looks scared of something. Who cares? Mitsuru. Huh? A spirit is haunting you. Will you cut it out, Shinobu? You know, sometimes your jokes aren't as funny as you think they are. Who says I'm joking? It's not true. You've got it all wrong. No, I don't. You've never really trusted me, have you? Please don't do that! Really focused on your homework, huh? Ugh. You have Mrs. Takayama for classics, right? I have to hand this in tomorrow, so don't bug me, okay? Okay. Would, would you knock it off? I didn't do it. It must be a blackout. A blackout? <sighs> Just when it was getting good. Hey, Shun, do you have a flashlight in your room? Uh-uh. Great, hope the power comes back on soon. All the other buildings are lit. It looks like Greenwood's the only place that's blacked out. Ah! What was... It's here. <laughs> Where did it come from? Mitsuru and I were watching television when the power went out. Then the screen turned white, and this thing came floating out of it. What is it? You know as well as I do, it's a ghost. Shinobu, you've got to do something to get rid of that ghost! What am I, a ghostbuster? <laughs> the show! The show! Oh, it dropped me back to level one again. So, just start all over. Start all over? I already spent a fortune getting up to level 16. Here you go. Hmm? Oh, thanks very much, but I can't drink anything. It just passed through me. <laughs> wow. And I can do cool stuff like this. Just watch. Whoop. Gee. Um, my name's Misako, and in case you're wondering, I'm 16 years old. Well, it's nice to meet you, Misako, but is this how you really look? Uh-huh. Then that scary version we saw before? Oh, no! That was just artistic license. After all, I am a ghost, so I try to look the way everybody expects me to at first, so they're not disappointed. Smart idea. Yeah, real smart. So, Misako, I take it you're here to haunt Mitsuru. Is that right? Yes, that's right. Well, in that case, I wish you the best of luck and very happy haunting. Oh, thank you. Now, wait a second. I We've just... We've had a lot of excitement, so maybe we should say goodnight. 
Hey, Misako, how long are you staying here? Well, because I'm a ghost, I have to clear up all my old loves and regrets before I can move on from here. And I just don't know exactly how long that's gonna take me yet. So you're staying for now? Yep! All right, finally something good is happening here at Greenwood. Mitsuro, you lucky stiff. I wish a cute girl like Misako would come and live with me for a while. Oh? Then why don't you try being haunted instead? Don't make him mad, you idiot! Good night, Misako! See you tomorrow! Well, I'm going to bed now. Aren't you gonna do anything to help me? What can I do? This is for you two to work out on your own. In this case, three's definitely a crowd. That's right, Mitsuru. Why don't you just give up and sleep with me? Uh, sleep with you? Right! <laughs> I'll be back in a second. I have to change. <laughs> <laughs> You know what, Ska? I always had a feeling Mitsuru's girl trouble would end up like this. She's really a pretty cute girl, I guess, but she really isn't my type. How about you, Ska? I bet she's the kind of girl you'd like to go out with, huh? Would you please just let me do my homework? Why are you haunting me? Pardon? Are you mad at me for something? Uh, well, yes I am. How can that be? I don't even know you. It's possible to hurt someone without knowing it, right? Well, you can hurt someone without knowing them too. Why don't you tell me what I did to you then? What's wrong? I'm cold. Huh? A ghost can feel cold? Mm, can I get in the bed with you? Absolutely not! Uh. Hmm? <laughs> oh, please? Uh, 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 do what you want. Yay! Thank you! Take it easy! Who? Oh, excuse me! There's something I should warn you about, miss. Yes? Mitsuro snores quite loudly. I never thought of that. Shinobu! I have to change in here. Why? What's wrong? I cannot get dressed in peace as long as that girl is in my room. Hey, Shinobu, I didn't know you were so shy. Don't be ridiculous. But just because she's a ghost doesn't mean she gets a free show. Did you have a good sleep, Misako? Uh-huh. If there's anything you need, just ask us, okay? Oh, thank you. Misako, um, maybe you could come to my room sometime. Sure. Would you come to my room, too? Would you guys cut it out? Look, Mitsuru, as long as you're haunted, we might as well make the best of it. And what is this? Uh... Mr. Ikeda, how dare you bring a girl into this dormitory? Ma'am, you don't understand. She's not a girl. No She's... excuses! And you! You brazen little hussy, you've got some nurse sneaking in here! Now get out and stay out! Tricks won't work with me. I'll throw you out myself. <laughs> you must be a ghost then. You're haunting Mr. Ikeda? It looks that way. Oh my. Oh. 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 I've seen all sorts of ghosts here over the years, but none as clearly as this one. Mr. Ikeda, you get her passed on as soon as possible. Ugh. Please, just don't follow me to class. But I'm haunting you, and that means I have to stay with you wherever you go. Well, could you at least make yourself invisible? Please? If I do, will you talk to me when you get back from class this afternoon? I will. I'll talk about anything you want. Then as a special favor, I'll stay invisible. You will? Oh, thank you. Ah. Mitsuru, huh? what are you doing?
<sighs> oh, you're alone. She's disappeared, I hope. I doubt it very much. They're not usually that easy to get rid of. Anyway, while she's gone, I'm gonna take a bath. stand up with you in here. Don't worry, I don't mind. Well, I do. This whole thing might be funny if it was just Mitsuru having trouble around here. What's the matter? Why aren't you going in there? It's occupied. The ghost girl. You mean Mitsuru and Misako are in there taking a bath together? Well, I'm not going in there with them. So, you were trapped in the tub and got a little overcooked. Shut up. You don't know what going through this is like. Just don't hog the bath from now on, okay? What are you telling me for? You're the one she's haunting, right? Mitsuru, why don't you at least try to do something to help her pass on? Yeah, why don't you? Believe me, I'm ready to do anything to get rid of you, but first I want to know exactly what's holding you down here. You mean... Huh? You mean you really don't remember? Uh, uh, did I really do something to hurt you? Ha! Fake out! We don't have to talk about this right now. There's no rush. Oh, yes, there is. If I did something to you, then tell me what it is now, because I want you out of here as soon as possible. Now talk! But why are you being so mean to me? You made her cry! <laughs> Get out of here. Huh? Ah! Hmm, now she's got me mad. You mean that wasn't an earthquake we felt last night? Uh-uh, Mitsuru made that girl cry and the whole place went crazy. My room shook so much that bottle of whiskey I had stashed away got smashed. We're right next door, so our whole room was trashed. I can't stand this. Yeah, neither can yeah, I. Yeah, I know what you mean. This is sort of like being boyfriend and girlfriend, isn't it, Mitsuru? I think we'd make a cute couple, don't you? <laughs> then maybe you'd like to be a ghost, too. <coughs> After all, I'll always be 16, but you're going to just keep getting older and older and older. Wait and... a minute. Huh? You're going to stay with me till I get old? Well, I haven't really decided 100% yet, <laughs> but I don't see any reason why not. So in other words, you're with me for good. Sure, it'll be lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you just get lost. I don't want you. Hey, don't make her cry, you jerk. You're causing problems for everybody in Greenwood. She's the one who's causing all the problems. Just deal with it, and we'll all be fine. See, Misako, Mitsuru didn't really mean all that stuff he said before. So don't cry, okay? Okay. I'm in hell. You know what I think? I think Mitsuru had a thing with her in junior high, and then he must have dumped her. And then she killed herself? That guy's a real monster. I find that highly unlikely. Yeah, why? She's wearing a Musashino Seika girl school uniform, so she must have lived near Mitaka. And that's across town from Mitsuru's home. 
Much too far apart for junior high school students to have had a relationship. He's right. How come you know so much about girls' school uniforms, hmm? A student council president knows these things. I'm so impressed. Well, still, there must be some reason she keeps following him around. Maybe she came to take back the spirit of their unborn baby. That's it. Maybe she's his long-lost sister. And maybe she got killed in an accident. Didn't have to be an accident. You mean, you mean she did something he didn't like, so he got her alone and... Huh? You guys look like you're having fun. Hey, Misako. Mind if I come in? Uh, sure, come on in. <laughs> I don't want you wandering around. Why not? Is she your property or something? Let's stay and drink with him, Mitsuru. Huh. Too bad you can't drink, Misako. Yeah, but I can still enjoy the atmosphere in here. I keep telling you, you've got it all wrong. Hmm? You don't love me Yes? Anymore. I don't think you ever loved me. Huh? Oh, did you knock? Good evening. What a surprise. Come in. I'm getting worried. About what? Misako's not here. Your shoulders should be relieved. I just don't like her wandering around the dorm by herself. What are you worrying about? You should use this chance to go to the bathroom or take a bath while you can. I'm going to look for... You know, I used to watch that show all the time when I was still alive. It's one of my favorites. I never thought I'd see how it turned out being dead and all. What happened between you and Mr. Ikeda? I'm responsible for the boys here at the dorm, you know, so I'd like to try to help you out if I can. Well, I was going to a girls' high school. I always went to private girls' schools ever since I was little, and I never really met that many boys. So I always dreamed of meeting a really handsome guy who'd want to be my boyfriend. <gasps> so you met Mitsuru and he took advantage of you? Man, please. Oh no, nothing like that happened. I just wanted to meet a guy and have a boyfriend, but then... Then? Then one day I was daydreaming and I got hit by a car and died. Oh my! Ha! The end! But I don't understand. Why are you haunting Mitsuru if you don't even know him? Well... I became a ghost because I was daydreaming about having a boyfriend, and then I found this boy storm. So I figured as long as I'm going to haunt a boy, it may as well be a handsome one. <laughs> so I didn't start out to haunt Mitsuru, it was just a coincidence. Well, you got what you wanted. Now it's best that you pass on. After all, you can't stay in a boy's dormitory. Yes, ma'am. You'll go then? Yes. Thank you. Hey! <gasps> Mitsuru! Was what you said in there true? Hey! <laughs> Did Misako come back here yet? You're standing on her. I'm sorry. So it isn't my fault you can't pass on after all. Now get out! You don't have to yell at me. Just get out then! <laughs> Here we go again. You clean up this time. You're making her cry again! Are you gonna keep doing this till you destroy Greenwood? Our room is getting trashed! Why don't you just marry her? All of you, shut up! She's getting out of here right now. Why are you doing this to me, Mitsuru? What have I ever done to you? You're a pest. I only wanted to be with you. 
That's why you're such a pest! Is it because I'm a ghost? Yes, that's partly why. Well, even a ghost... Even a ghost... Even a ghost likes to be with the one she loves! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Misako, you've been with Mitsuru for several days now, but under the circumstances, you can't stay with him forever. So what more do you need to leave this world behind? I, I, I want Mitsuru. I want him to kiss me. Do it, Mitsuru! Or else! What are you talking about? First of all, how can I kiss her when I can't even touch her? I could possess someone's body. Like who? It would have to be somebody with very strong spiritual powers. Don't even think about it. That goes double for me! You have to do it! Come on, Shinobu! For the sake of peace in the dorm, do it, Shinobu! That's right! Misako, go ahead and possess Shinobu. Mm-mm. <laughs> As long as he guards his heart so tightly, I won't be able to get in. Selfish! Yeah, can't you unguard your heart for just a minute? I'm very sorry, Masako, but I'm afraid I won't be able to grant you your wish. I feel sort of sorry for her. I wonder if she's gone for good. Misako. That's all I wanted, Mitsuru. Thank you. Ah! Huh? It's snowing. It really piled up out there. I always heard you had the worst luck with girls, Mitsuru. Hmm. <laughs> Looks like it's true. When Asakawa can say that, you're doomed, Mitsuru. Yeah, you're just jealous, but you can have her if she ever comes back. No, thanks, like we didn't have enough trouble. Huh? Now what? Another blackout? Ha! I scared you, didn't I? Damn it, Shun, don't do that again! Yeah, I really thought she came back. I think she has. Huh? Ding dong! Ta da! Ah! Hey, come on in! Hi, everybody! Hello there! Nice to meet you! Oh, Miss Sako, you were right! They really are handsome! See? These girls were haunting around, so I made friends with them. I told them where to find some cute guys, so they asked me to bring them here. Oh, I'm so glad I was haunting around around here! Getting to have fun again, it's a dream come true! I to enjoy myself before I pass on. <laughs> now that I kissed Mitsuru, I can't get him out of my mind. Uh -huh. Hey, right! Who just wants to kiss and run? I'm so lucky I didn't pass on right away. So how do we decide who gets which one? Mitsuru's mine. Hands off. Oh, no fair, Misako. I found this place first, didn't I? And we're grateful. But how do we choose? This is a real buyer's market. Oh, it's great to be alive. <laughs> Except we're dead. 
Mitsuru, when are we gonna take another bath together, hmm? A bath? Oh, wow! <laughs> Come on, it's a ghost privilege! Right! Let's hurry up and choose boyfriend! I know! Let's do rock 